<laughs> some rough hair situations, but um, I wanted to check in. I'm getting ready to go to bed. I feel a little bad because I am not, I'm slipping into some bad habits. I didn't work out this morning. It's Wednesday. I was supposed to go and I, um, I slept through it and I just feel some of those bad <laughs> jujus coming back and rearing their ugly head. So it just makes me a little bit nervous. Um, I haven't been eating well. I've never gotten on a good um, change and I haven't been planning and I haven't been preparing and that shows and I know it's compromising my progress. Um, so I'm just sitting here watching the West Wing. I should be sleeping and I just feel a little bit restless lately. I don't know if it's kind of like end of the summer blues even though there hasn't really been a summer. I'm not sure but I wanted to just check in and I am doing the August ab challenge, which I can post down below. Um, I'm doing that with my coworkers, so I've stayed pretty true to that. But I only took like 2,000 steps today, which is just abysmal. So um, I think to make up for it, I'm going to do the Friday and the Saturday class so I can get my three in for the week. And I still haven't gone to get running shoes, so maybe I'll do that tomorrow after work. But I hope everyone is doing really well, and I'm still excited, and let me just see how many days are left. Fifty-eight days, so that's kind of scary. That makes my stomach hurt a little bit. Also the abs. <laughs> so, um, hope you guys had a good day, and um, don't judge my hair, and I will talk to you all soon. Good morning! It's me! I know, you probably don't even remember my face. I have been, um, not good at life. It's just I've gotten on a bad path and then I've had some meetings and interviews in the mornings, which it just, I know I could have done it, but to go to the gym, get all sweaty and gross, get ready for an interview, drive away, because right now, where I'm going is like one exit from where I work. Driving all the way over here to Lenox Village and then driving back was just like too much for me. And I think I just needed a couple of days. And, excuse me, I was kind of annoyed because my trainer was kind of on my ass. Like, she emailed me and then she called me and I didn't call her back because I just didn't want to explain myself and I saw that Instagram post I'll try to find it and put it below and it said uh, it says something like instead of saying that you don't have time for something say that it's not a priority and to be honest for the past week it was not a priority and I know this is not like the right attitude to have because <sighs> You know, it's like really nice that she was checking on me and I just am sometimes too stubborn for my own good. But I wanted to check in and say that I am going back and I have like literally, I shouldn't say literally, um, since that all happened, my seatbelt is like choking me. Since I stopped going, I have not thought about the warrior dash like I've blocked it out of my mind which is not a good thing I didn't get my running shoes I've just I've just been struggling so I'm trying to get back on track um today so and I didn't wear my pedometer I'm just I'm gonna get back on track if not today then tomorrow and I know I've spoken about it before but my job is just weighing really heavy on me right now and so I've had a couple of interviews this week which is really good news and I hope that something pans out for me because I'm ready. So I missed you guys and I missed watching other people's videos. Oh, that's the other thing I wanted to ask. If you have any really good weight loss vloggers, bloggers, I'd love to know down below. And I'm going to put together probably a list of people that I read and who inspire me. So, um... Is this crazy hire? 
I hope you all are doing better than I'm doing and I will talk to you soon.